This is WENY HD News. Good morning, Twin Tears. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. John, what's the weather looking like? Beautiful today. Just, just took a little peek outside. Start to see some clouds come in, but that won't stop our temperatures from coming up nicely today. We're talking about mid-70s as opposed to the low 70s that we had yesterday. So, an improvement. That's always what we're looking for, right? A little, <laughs> little improvement to your forecast. Let's go see what's going on in the Crystal City now. Starting to see the clouds roll in. Out in Corning this morning, temperatures are also pretty cool. We'll see them rebound nicely going into your afternoon, though. Highs this afternoon soar into the mid-70s. Look to your weather headlines for the next few days. Enjoy this day. I can't stress it enough. In fact, if you haven't gone out maybe for an evening stroll yesterday, get it in today because we're in for some rain both tomorrow, Friday, even into your weekend too. Some nice dry hours and some sunshine to enjoy today. Some unsettled days lie ahead as I mentioned. And the weekend, well, it looks like the rainiest of the two days would be Saturday. Sunday, the drier of the two as there are at least some rain chances in the forecast for Saturday morning. At uh, the airport right now, 38 degrees, so it's a cool start. Sunny? I don't think so. I think that icon is, uh, oh, maybe it hit the snooze button. It hasn't updated yet. It's certainly looking pretty cloudy out in that direction over in Big Flats. 44 in Dansville, 41 in Wellsboro now, 42 Corning, 47 in Penyon. So notice our valleys are the coolest. You get up to some of the higher hills. It is a little bit warmer. As we spin the map around for you, looking at some more cool temperatures. Lots of mid-40s from Old Mountain to Erin at 41, 42 Lansing, 39 though up at the hill there in Mansfield. Satellite radar wise, nothing on radar, but you can see this batch of clouds and it's a little extra bright white here. Indicates some thicker clouds starting to move in from the west. We'll find some times though, I'm pretty confident in that, that we'll see some sun and not just clouds around. But as we work our way through the day, seeing the sunshine becoming less and less likely as we start to thicken up the cloud cover from the west. We've got a five degree guarantee today of 76 degrees. It's about five degrees warmer than yesterday. Notice tonight, not nearly as cool. We'll have a cloudy sky, mid 50s will do it for tonight. Much more comfortable if you forgot and left the windows open. To the bigger picture we go, high pressure offshore pumping in some warmer southerly breezes for today. Eventually this area of low pressure catches up with us for Thursday and continues into Friday. We'll also monitor another area of low pressure down to the south off of the screen that will actually impart, impact part of your weekend. Look to future track for now, looking at some cloud cover starting to stream in here through the day. Pretty confident though that we see some sunshine at times, especially in the morning, and it's at least that milky kind of sun. You can still see it through the clouds even this afternoon. For tomorrow though, that's going to change. Cloudy day, seeing the rain move in as early as about 8 o'clock in the morning. There'll be periods of steady and even heavy rain though going into your Thursday afternoon. Same story continues into your Friday as well as that next area of low pressure lifts up from the Gulf. Looks like the highest impacts from that second area of low pressure though will be to our east. Still can't rule out periods, periods of rain, even here in the tears, though. Seven-day forecast, well, it looks pretty wet and dank. We're looking at temperatures in the low 70s Saturday, warmer on Sunday. That's the drier of the two days. Potentially another weather system heads our way, though, with more rain chances for early next week.